right, guys, what's up? Welcome back. Welcome to another Borderlands 3 showcase. I almost said welcome back two times in a row. <laughs> Lol. Uh, anyways, though, guys, uh, what we're doing, we're going over today is going to be uh, possibly one of the best uh, Hyperion shotguns in the game. It's up there with like, the face punch and the conversion, stuff like that. Uh, that's going to be the reflex here. I am a very, very big fan of this gun. I love this shotgun a lot. Uh, it's very good. I saw the Guardian takedown with this thing. It's, it was like one of the weapons I used to get my initial Guardian takedown there before it got it. Before the Guardian takedown got a uh, a toned down uh, on flak. Uh, so that's pretty cool. And overall, I just really like this weapon. Uh, we have the times 14 puppy with this one. Uh, obviously, if you do want to farm for it, you got to go farm Genevieve on Mayhem 6 over on the Brocious Canopy on Eden 6. Uh, let's, real quick, though, let's go over our setup. I don't want to be here too, too long because that's the reflex. A lot of people know how good this gun is. But uh, I just really want to do a showcase on it because it's been a minute since we did one of these. So, uh, so our main thing, we're going for a lot of ASCs, Radiation, Cryo, Shock, and obviously the stuff he has, Corrosive. Uh, we do have the Bounty Hunter with Weapon Crit, Weapon Damage, Hyperion Crit. However, I feel like with this thing, uh, is Stack Bot is also a very, very good decision. So if I feel the need to, um, I will switch over to this Stack Bot that has Weapon Crit and Shotgun Damage, which is very, very nice. Uh, and then on top of that, guys, obviously we do have our Pearl, uh, which is going to be very, very nice. And then here is our Shocker Tree that you love to see. Hidden Machine with this, uh, with the Reflex, is very, very good. We're going to be chaining our three-shot fadeaways fairly consistent. So, uh, yeah, just keep that in mind. We're going to be going in and out of fadeaway as much as we can. Uh, here's our hunter tree. Obviously, there's no need for two fang with the times 14 weapon. Obviously, Mega Vlar, like Chato, duh, the, the reflex. You're gonna want, you want to go in the red tree with the reflex for sure. Um, and here's our master tree. Uh, Person Sunner, a little bit of go for the eyes, and then uh, he bites to help out our frenzy stacks. Uh, and then we have max out agility training because we will be reloading this thing a lot because it is a times 14. But yeah, guys, with that stuff being said, we're gonna go start things over in the slaughter shaft. Fuck up shit over there, and I'll see y'all over there. All right, y'all, we're here. We're at the slaughter shaft. Oh man, let's just oh let's just go on a terror. Oh, this this thing is absolutely devastating to everything and everybody. Um, I this might be my favorite shotgun, and I said that dude, I said that in the last video or in a, in a recent boom uh, sickle showcase video. I said this might be my favorite shotgun. To be fair, dude, let's just be real. The shotguns in this game are like there's so many options you could say is the best shotgun you could say the hellwalker is the best you could say the reflex is the best you could make a case that the convergence is up there you could obviously make a case for the face puncher uh, the reflux i mean there's there's a lot and the boom sickle to like there you got so much uh did i even mention the hellwalker i'm pretty sure i did because like the hellwalker goes without saying as being in the uh, top echelon of shotguns but like it's just Overall, dude, I feel like shotguns in this game have like the most options you can you could argue for like best of its class. There's so many you got here, man. You got so many options with with the shotguns in this game. It's just overall pretty awesome. Uh, so yeah, I mean, oh, dude. Also, I mean, there's a few decent Malawan shotties too. Like the Trevenator is not bad at all. I'm not saying the Trevenator is the best. The Recursion. I mean, hello, you can't forget about the Recursion even after it's uh. The projectile nerf i mean that thing is still a complete tank so i mean hey hey uh yeah dude it looks like we're not even gonna have to worry about switching to that stack bot i mean we're we're, chew we're i mean we are just chewing i mean we're chewing through these fools bro we're not built for it we're not built for the task at hand y'all can't handle it y'all cannot handle this thing the reflux bro i mean this if Whenever this gun was first introduced in Mayhem 10, this thing just jumped off the page like, oh, we just got a Pack-a-Punch Reflux. <laughs> Pack-a-Punch Reflux. A Pack-a-Punch Brainstormer. Damn it. The, I mean, the Reflux and the Brainstormer are carbon copies of each other. The Reflux is just better in every every situation because it just it has more base damage. Like, point blank. Now, I've always been a fan of running consecutives on my shotguns. However, I feel like the Reflux is so good, you don't even need to have consecutives on it. Plus, whenever uh, the Guardian Takedown first came out, uh, I use a Consec Kits Reflux. I use a Consec Kits times 7 and times 14, and it was not enough. I had to get one with next two mags of uh, shock. Because the Guardian Takedown was just that difficult back then. But anyways, though, guys, with that stuff being said and out the way, let's go ahead and let's just go play a little bit around the Guardian Takedown, and then we'll obviously we'll head to the Malawan Takedown. All right, ladies and gents, we're at the Guardian Takedown. We're going to fuck some shit up here. It's the reflex, man. The reflex is just—it's it, what it does. It—it—it's the best mobbing shotgun in the game. It's—it's it's too good. It's so good. It's just so goddamn powerful, dude. 
the chaining on this thing, getting as many ASCs going with it, it's, it's what you want. That's exactly what you want. As you can see, <laughs> plus, you know, chaining three shot Fado with this thing is super, super easy. And it just makes for Hidden Machine to be that, you know, that much more useful uh, with a gun like this. It's just... <sighs> I mean, I've done, I think, I want to say this might be the fourth showcase we've done uh, with this puppy. And uh, I, I like the shotgun a lot, dude. Like, it, it, I've always loved this thing. Like, whenever, like, and people are, like, asking me, if, like, yo, what's, like, some of the best weapons to use for Flag? This one and the Monarch are, like, the first two that come out of my mouth. Oh, and then you obviously have, you know, your Hellwalkers. The Backburner Black Bear are going to be good on, every, on any Vol Hunter. But, I mean, you just get so much bang for your buck with this with this shotgun. It's just so good, dude. It just does so much damage. I mean, you're seeing, you're seeing, the, you're, you're seeing it, man. You're, I mean, obviously, uh, people that are watching this, I know some of you guys are long term, uh, long time players of this game, so you already know how good this gun is. Of course, you know there's uh, always going to be some new people to the game, some new people that might not know how good the shotgun is or how it works and everything like that. So you know, it's always good to do showcases on uh, guns that we've done in the past. Again, just you know, helps out some of the newer people that might be watching some, uh, the channel and stuff like that. But uh, dude, let's just let's just. <laughs> It's just a beast. It's a beast from the east. Let's go back into fadeaway, dude. I mean, we're 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 chewing everything up, dude. I mean, I say this some I say this sometimes, you know, like whenever we are whenever I'm doing showcase videos and stuff like that, uh, it's pretty nice to do. Like whenever I'm hopping into a, a gun that I already know is going to slap, it's really nice. So it's just like, yeah, I'm just gonna be big chilling throughout this video. I'm just gonna you know be slaughtering everything. Uh, the gun's gonna do all the work for me. You know what I'm saying? I gotta do shit. Uh, yeah, I mean, this was the first gun, uh, our first Guardian takedown only solo weapon was the Reflux because it was this powerful. But uh, yeah, with all that stuff being said, guys, let's go ahead and head over to the Malawan takedown. All right, y'all, we're here. We're at the Malawan takedown. We're just, we're, we're gonna, just, we're gonna fuck them up, dude. We're, we're, it's, it's the Reflux, dude. I mean, they, they don't stand a chance. They just don't. Like, that's... Oh, flamethrower heavyweight. See, I'm on flak now, bro. So that's not a problem. You can you, you can send me nothing but flamethrower heavyweights, and you're still gonna get wrecked. That's the only ASC I don't have uh, with this setup. So yeah, sit down, get off me, war dog. You're not built for the task at hand, my guy. Neither are you. Oh yeah, just yeah, get wrecked. Oh man, Kraken's already to show his face already. All right, say less, brother. I got I got the reflex for you. Yep, yep. It's, yep, 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 that's exactly, yep, I expect nothing less. All right, y'all, so we're here, we're at the bridge, obviously, uh, this is just, it's the bridge, man, so everything just is gonna die. Nope, nothing here is gonna stand a chance. L literally nothing. Nothing, nothing's gonna stand a chance here, dude. It's it's the reflux, it, it changed, it kills everything. Black, to, Black to Shadow Megavar, you... <laughs> You can jump all you want. You're still gonna die. <laughs> Sorry, War Dogs. This is, can't can't wheels your way out of this thing. It chains, brother. It chains, and the chains are devastating. Plus, when you got multiple ASCs going. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Let's go back into that fadeaway builder. Oh uh, yeah. You're donezo. I'll reload. That's fine. You know what? I'll save you for later. <laughs> everything's just getting wrecked, dude. I just everything's just sitting. It's just getting destroyed. Obviously, you know, the, the, the main anointments you want on this thing is any next two mags or consecutives, and that's going to be perfectly fine. You're going to completely destroy everything. I, I, like, you're, you're seeing what we're doing now, dude. Everything is just, just getting completely cooked. They, they, they just can't handle the heat. They can't handle it, dude. It's too good. The reflux is just way too good. Look at this thing. Y'all are, like, dude. Do I really need to commentate about why the reflux is good? I mean, goddamn, we've done like four showcases on this puppy. Flamethrower heavyweight, doesn't matter. Get right, sit down, brother. Sit down. Stealth commando? Oh, man. Not so stealthy now, huh, homie? Get down. Get out of my face, bro. Sit down. Get wrecked. All right, fellas, I'm just gonna go ahead and cut over to the Wolkton Schmolkton Schmackdown, and I'll see y'all over there. Okay, fellas, so here we are. We're at the Wolkton Schmolkton Schmackdown. This will definitely be one of the uh, quicker kills um, on Moton because it's the reflux. It's kind of what it does. He can spawn his death spheres. That's only going to hurt him more. Poor guy. Poor Woton. Nope. Get wrecked. 
You just ain't got a chance, bro. You you just don't have a chance, man. Like that's what you gotta understand, Wotan. You just you don't got a chance, bro. Wotan, your chances of surviving are zero. Your chances are just so low. You just can't. You 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 just ain't got it. You just ain't got what it takes, bro. Oh, and the chain. Oh, man. This good old chain. Yep. That guy's dead. I'm surprised he didn't glitch out immediately. Jump back down. There you go. There you go. Yeah, this is this is the reflux for you. Totally, totally balanced. 100%. <laughs> oh, my God. Dude, I told y'all it was going to be a quick Wotan kill. I told you guys. You see what I'm saying? How good this gun is? If there's any new players out there watching this and you're a flak player, you, you got any player really, you got to get your hands on the reflex, especially if you are a flak player. This is a must have for flak. But uh, anyways, guys, hope y'all did enjoy the video. If y'all did enjoy the video, make sure to drop your load on that like button and subscribe if you're new on the road to 6K subs. You know what I'm saying, my boy? Uh, let's go over the setup real quick and be real fast. A uh, bunch of ASCs, radiation uh, next to max. We were rocking the times 14 the whole time. Obviously, you have a times 7. You won't reload as much, but your damage will be a little bit less. Good old plus ultra for that extra health, uh, cryo uh, and shock because we already have radiation and corrosive on this thing. Uh, then here is the bounty hunter that we use, Hyperion, weapon crit, weapon damage, all that good jazz. Um, and then here is our pearl of ineffable knowledge, you know what I'm saying, good old pearl. Trapper for the extra reloading because times 14 you reload way more. Here's our little master troop we got going on. Uh, he by itself is frenzy, so that's all I expect into that. Here's our hunter tree. Mainly, you just need to get that Galactic Shadow Megavar. Obviously, Interplanet Fairy Stalker is a must have. And then, big game, most dangerous game, always good to have. Um, and then, here's our Stalker tree with uh, power inside, a little bit of rage recover. This is actually a gun that works really, really, really good with Hidden Machine, so that's how we yeah, max it out. Uh, and then, everything else is pretty uh, standard. But uh, yeah, guys, thank y'all so much for watching the video. My name's Cree, and we'll see y'all in the next one. Peace out, everybody.